Today on yes, Cocktails like and Cousins, it. when they get over the taste of the wine, we can I'm move good forward. You got to get over it now. I'm that, been over it after that first it. taste. You got to finish that cup. We're going to be talking about male influencers. <laughs> male influencers? Yes, influencers online. Influencers. So, okay. So let me give a bit of an example, and hopefully no. our people are still with us because you went off on a tangent. Um, so I don't know if you all are familiar with like it's also a podcaster named Ace Metaphor. I don't know if anybody you guys ever heard of him before. So he basically focuses on toxic men. So what he talks about to women is how to avoid and deal with toxic men, like how to avoid them, how not to be with them, like to know how to see them, where they are. Know who they are before you know who they are. Facts. And then I know you all, please tell me y'all remember Derek Jackson. Everybody I remember Derek Jackson, right? Yeah. So Derek Jackson is similar to him a little bit. It's just that Derek got caught up in some shit. So really now everybody looking at him like "Eh, whatever. It is. Facts, right? Um, but he ended up staying in his marriage and now it's pretty much like he knows all now because I'm still with my wife, you know. Remember, she was in the video he with him, like it. she was in the sunken place. Like, I don't know what's going on. Oh, I, I yes. So we will talk about that too. He got caught again. No, that, you know, bring bring talk talking on us. Bring like, it. Minute. Come on here. He got caught up again. So and his wife was I don't know if it was a skit or if she had um it maybe took something. You know, I don't know. She was a little special. She she was in the sunken place. She really was. It was just like, I'm here. I don't know what's going on. So I just kind of wanted to talk about some of the things that they talk about in these things. And Steve Harvey is another one. You know, Steve Harvey really got most of his fortune after writing that book. You know, come on now. <laughs> I mean, some of that stuff is like the three, the three P's that he came up with. You know, if a man can't provide, protect, or profess... You ain't supposed to be with him. I'm trying to tell you. Speak a word. In the word. Just, you know. Okay. So, listen, sometimes people could tell it better than, than, they, do than it. they can practice. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. But no, I'm going to tell you how I feel about that. I feel like sometimes people have to experience things, go through things, and you can tell them from your experience. Like, I, you know, I was a fuck up. I cheated all the time, and I did all this, that, and the third. Now, let me tell you what I did back in the heyday. Not like Derrick Jackson, who's doing it right now. Again. Again. Constant. Constantly. Uh-oh. Yeah. See what I'm saying? Mm-mm. Shut up. You did it before. So, <laughs> at the end of the day, I mean, I kind of want to get y'all's opinion about, I mean, do you think that we should be listening to these men? I mean, some of that stuff be real though. I mean, you know, I'm gonna pull up some examples, Gigi. I know you are. I'm gonna pick some, pull some up. You be having everything in your roller decks of shit. I mean, it's just, it's just real. Hey, Sean. Hey, girl. Hey. (laughs) 